creature is a loggerhead sea turtle that came to us on May 8th. She was found about a half a mile offshore from the Sand Pearl in Clearwater Beach. Uh, she was actually found floating by some residents that were out boating. They were actually able to bring her here to the aquarium with their boat. We were able to take Creature for a CT scan and we noticed that she had a lot of shell material actually in her GI tract that was actually pushing up on her lungs. And this is actually why we suspect that maybe she had some sort of a buoyancy disorder. We were able to give her something called TPN and it's basically a type of nutrition that we give IV um, in order for her to pass that shell material that was actually in her GI tract. We didn't want to add any more solid food to that. We started introducing squid to her, which she seems to really enjoy. as well as the big jumbo pink shrimp. Um, so she is fed a hefty diet of that here at the aquarium. Throughout her stay here at the aquarium, we have periodically pulled her out, put her on a giant scale, we can get a weight on her. We've also been scrubbing her carapace or shell. Uh, we wanna make sure that it's nice and clean and nice and smooth so they're able to apply that satellite tag when she's ready. On June 21st is our lucky day. Creature's going to be released on Clearwater Beach. We're very fortunate to obtain FWC approval and the, we're working with Sea Turtle Conservancy to get her a satellite tag. And this information that we're going to gain from this tag is invaluable. It's going to tell us so much about where she came from, where is she going, um, where's her foraging grounds, what are her migrational patterns. This information is really important because not too many facilities have had the opportunity to actually satellite tag a rehabilitated turtle. We did have the opportunity to satellite tag one other turtle and that was Ozzy. Ozzy was a great success story. She actually traveled around the whole state of Florida um, and it was up in the Carolinas when her tag finally fell off about four months after we applied it. We're all very excited. Uh, we cannot wait. It takes a lot of work and effort to get to this point and we're really excited that we're going to be able to basically see the, the next part of Creature's story and we're going to be able to see her on a satellite tag and see where she's going. We are grateful for the opportunity to release and track Creature through our partnership with Sea Turtle Conservancy. Clearwater Marine Aquarium is a non-profit rescue, rehab and release facility that needs your help. The cost for rehabbing a sea turtle can be over $300 a day. Satellite tagging, which includes software, monthly charges, and additional fees, costs approximately $10,000. Please consider making a contribution to help us continue these efforts and support Creature on her journey home.